Never met someone like you or felt something like your touch. I wish we would have met tonight. Sure, I've had lovers in my past. Won't lie, I've had a blast. But none of them had your humor. They can't compare. No one could ever do. Nobody's close to you. Yeah. One night's not fair. What can I say to make you never leave this room? I'm going to call Ms. Aaron Chapwood, especially this year. Hello, hello everyone. Happy Thursday. I'm starting this at not the best time because I just brushed my teeth and put my retainer in, so I'm probably talking funny, but it's been a long travel day. Me, Zane, Jerry, and Ever, his mom and stepdad, all traveled together. My parents were already here. They're staying longer than we are. It was actually such a nice travel day. It was so much fun, but all we did was we went on the plane and then my dad picked us up he rented a car here and then we went and got whataburger and then we came back to the house and a lot of my like immediate family was here my aunt my uncle my cousins um so we were all just like mingling saying hi to each other and then just now <laughs> my parents do this thing where they just want to they just like to chat and like show people things and like talk about things like especially like this upcoming trip like my mom would just call me randomly and just be like all right so i think i'm gonna wear these shoes and like just like random the randomest things so did you see this did you see that and they kept going into jerry and ever's room because we're all staying at my sister's tonight and then we have an airbnb tomorrow anyways my parents kept going into the room they're like so tired trying to go to bed and like you guys just keep going into their room and showing them the most random shit and then it just became this joke of us just going in there and showing them random shit so we got like little videos of it and it was actually hilarious. <laughs> what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I need help! Oh my god. No, no. What do you need? What, you need help? What are you showing them? You put your girl and I. Did Jerry make like, you this shirt? Yeah. Go, show, go say I got this shirt on Etsy. Etsy. Look at this shirt I got on Etsy. <laughs> I'm, I'm your fucking Etsy. Okay? I'm your Etsy. Etsy my ass. Etsy my ass. <laughs> Anywho, Zane and I are in our little room and we're getting ready for bed. I got this travel thing on TikTok shop and it's literally so good. I think it was like anywhere from like two to three dollars, like something really ridiculous. I have my jewelry all up here, my perfume right here. And then this is like my deodorant, my hair products. I have a hairbrush and this front zipper. I also noticed, I didn't even realize this before, it's got a pocket back here too. Didn't even realize that, but I fit so much stuff in here and it's so nice and compact. My hairspray, my dry shampoos, like all my little travel things and my little like pill organizers. How amazing is that? So I love this thing. Oh my God, I wish I filmed it too. When we were sitting at Whataburger, I knew that my Aunt Kim was here and I was like, she's gonna answer the door. And I like predicted exactly what she was gonna do. I was like, she's gonna open her arms like this and she's gonna go, oh my God, just like that. And that's exactly what she did when they opened the front door. And I was not filming. I was just like in the moment, like saying hi to my family. And I was so mad that I didn't film it because it was literally the funniest thing ever. And then we looked back at the ring footage and it missed it by like literally a few seconds. You hear me going, I said, she was gonna do that it was really funny but yeah this is already so much fun i love like having 
it's like a slumber party all of us because we're all on the same floor and it's just it's fun so far that is that um just wanted to fill you guys in start this vlog off i know i like didn't talk to you today they're still laughing i hear them What are you guys doing? You're still bothering them? You're missing, you're missing out. <laughs> <laughs> you told me that. Ew, I gotta wear red shorts. Look, I got a red t-shirt. What? Sissy texted you. What did she say? I'm going to jump in the jacket up there. Question mark, then she said, Is someone practicing for a marathon? <laughs> In other words, I love you. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Unhinged. Oh, oh, I fucking can't. Crying, laughing. I can't. Did you make sure you show them everything? I'm fucking going to bed now. Okay, bye. Did you show them everything? I'll show you in the morning. Okay, we'll show you more more show and tell in the morning. I gotta go to bed. Guess what I have? This is Zane and I's bed set up. <laughs> what is that? Is that the noise machine? Wow. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Good morning, guys. Um. Do I look all right? Slept lovely. I was so exhausted from traveling. And I just got done working on my phone. It's so nice not having like at home distractions. I can just wake up, get my ish done. And now I can just enjoy the rest of the day. I got my short form content all uploaded. My vlog went up today and that feels amazing. And what's even more amazing, Megan Trainer announced her tour. I've been waiting for this moment. I am a Megan Trainer stan. Her music is just so much fun to me. And I just adore her personality and I love her. And ever since she um, announced her second pregnancy, I was like, oh, now she's never gonna go on tour. And she finally is and I'm so excited. So catch me at the New York show. I'm like, September 25th, I don't think I have anything that day, but if I do, um, I no longer do. So I can't wait for tickets to go on sale next week, and I'm so <laughs> If you listen to like the podcast, I'm pretty sure I've said it multiple times that I'm just sitting here waiting for Megan Trainer to announce her next tour. <laughs> and I'm so excited. And it's with the other, a few other fun people too. Natasha Benningfield, um, Paul Russell, Chris Olsen's gonna be there, and then her brother too. I don't know what they're gonna do, but regardless. Me and my mom are going. I'm gonna get us tickets for my mom's birthday because her birthday is September 19th. So I'm like, perfect. My mom loves Megan too. So I'm so excited for that. That was a big boost in my day. I don't need this. Um, we're going on a walk. The Unfortunately, the weather is gonna be really crappy this weekend. So her wedding's probably gonna have to be indoors. It was supposed to be outdoors. And we were telling her yesterday, we're like, um, did I say we were here for my sister's wedding? I think that's obvious. We were telling her yesterday, you know, but uh, rain is kind of good luck. She's like, yeah, I just don't care. I just wanted to do it outside. <laughs> I'm like, I feel that. I would be the same exact way. Like, I just don't care about the good luck thing. It's just, I don't want it to rain. <laughs> yeah, so today was supposed to rain this morning. It didn't, but it's really cloudy. But we're going on a walk. Family walk, get some movement in this morning. What am I gonna wear? It's like 70 something. I have an exercise dress. I have a little onesie, I have biker shorts and a top, I have leggings. I think I'm gonna do the exercise dress, that's like easy. And then I just brought my Dr. Scholl sneakers because I feel like they looked cute throughout the airport. And then also I knew I was gonna do some walking here. Old me would never, but new me loves exercise on a vacation. It just makes me feel so good. I love starting my day with it. I just enjoy myself so much better. I do honestly love it for my mental health. I just feel so good. So I don't know how we went there from Dr. Scholl sneakers, but I've got Dr. Scholl sneakers. They're so comfortable. I bought these for our Italy trip, which went on Delta app. We're leaving in like 37 days, which is crazy. But I was like, I'm not gonna not wear them until then. So we have to get them a little clean room before we go. But anyways, okay. I'm gonna put on this exercise dress. We're gonna go on a little family walk and tonight's her rehearsal dinner. So, oh, and we're checking into our Airbnb today. So that'll be fun too. Tan is tanning also. Love her, looks so good. The tan line, <gasps> very good. Thank you, Lauren. <laughs> Alrighty, dress is on, it's Amazon. One of my little sneaks. Oh, I wanna play tennis. You do. <laughs> Cute. Every time I come and visit, I tell my sister, I need a full length mirror in these rooms. And so she got them this time, yay! Amazing. The moms are momming. There's bacon, there's coffee, they're chatting. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh, there you are. The moms are momming. <laughs> All of a sudden, I just hear you guys go, <laughs> Little half up, half down. Okay, yeah. We're gonna show Jerry the neighborhood. So fun having everyone here. I'm loving it. Hello. 
little turtles. How cute. All right, we just walked for like an hour. It felt amazing. It was, it's very, very warm here, sweating. But now we got early check-in for our Airbnb, which is so nice because we can just go settle. So we're gonna go grab a bite at Torchy's Tacos, which we went to last time. It was really delicious. So we're gonna have fam try it. And then we're gonna check into our Airbnb. So we're like getting all packed up. Zane's got getting the blanket. Sorry. Right <laughs> and um, then we're gonna come back here and help my sister set up for the wedding tomorrow. And then we have rehearsal dinner at five o'clock. So that's like the itinerary for today. And I'm excited. It's gonna be a fun day. I'm taking my morning supplements because I forgot to. Oh my god. <gasps> this one looks so cool. Yeah, this it's is got ritual. Little beads in it. That's my multivitamin and then my cranberry and my seed symbiotic because we gotta keep everything flowing. Alright? Nice. Even on a vacation, move your body, take your supplements, alright? Wow, I look like that. <laughs> we need to blow up. We're gonna be running around sweating all day, so that's gonna have to happen later. Off we go. Oh. All right, we're at Torchies. Fun, fun. Guys, I'm sitting outside. Yum. So I got fried avocado, a tipsy chick, and then a, what else did I get? Oh, and a green chili pork. Yum. So excited. Oh my goodness, this looks so good. Thank We've got the tipsy Thank chick, you. fried avocado, and then the pork one. F it up. And it's so gorgeous outside, and we're all sitting and eating. Core memories, guys, core memories. All right, next up, liquor store. The liquor stores here are like Walmart, they're massive. It's wild. There's everything you could ever want. Look what they got. Wait, is this not Cardi B's brand? Yeah. Yes, it is, look. It's Cardi B. Vodka infused. Vodka infused whipped cream. Lime, caramel, mocha, strawberry, vanilla, and peppermint. Peppermint on our peppermint thing. On our peppermint shots and Christmas. <gasps> New edition. I don't really eat whipped cream enough to like, yeah, actually wow. buy that. But it's probably good. It's like a whip shot. You can just do it in people's mouth. That's fun. Very fun. Yeah, what is it? What percent is it? Oh, it's right on the front. 10. Wait. 10%. Oh. 10%. Wow. That's good. That's high. Nice. One day we'll try that. Look at all these minis. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's a cucumber baka. Yum. Wow. Isn't this fun? It's like little travel things. Like when you're going away on a vacation, you go to pick travel stuff, but it's liquor. Horchata. Look at this. This is horchata. Oh my god, literally after eating three tacos, any of this makes me want to. Vomit. Yeah. Next on the list yeah. is we're dropping like stuff that. off <laughs> at the venue. Here you go. Yay! Got it? Okay. Chairs are not looking, looking good. What do you mean? Pretty beat up. You don't like them? <gasps> really? Looking dirty, no? Did you open one? No, but. We'll get a magic eraser up in here and we'll start wiping them down. I'm that. I will. Because I can't make centerpieces, so. They're fine. Yeah. Yeah. I think we can definitely clean them. Uh, I mean, they're a little dark. But also, there. like, they should have. Yeah. The company that you rented yeah, from. That's, like a little, that's okay. It'll be dark. Yeah. It's all good. We're getting out the three wedding chairs. Okay, ready? Yep. This is our humble abode for the next few nights. How cute! Oh, big skaters. Ooh. Ooh. They're gonna get us. That home's the one in the house. Yeah. That's the last thing we need is giant mosquito bites for the wedding. Here we go. Oh, <gasps> Shut up! Thanks, Bob. <gasps> Guys! Oh! There's a love sack! Oh, it smells amazing. Oh my goodness, how cute! Nice little kitchen. How, oh my god, there's a backyard! Wow! Look how cute! A little office. What else we got? Another bedroom, and then another bedroom. Wow, is this a bathroom? My bathroom. So cute. We just discovered in the room my parents are staying in, they have their own bathroom over here. How nice! 
nice. Two bathrooms, two showers. Perfect. Okay, all right. We're going to Walmart. We're gonna stock up, and then we gotta get ready for tonight. We drink water like nuts, so we need a nice big pack. Nice 40 pack? Yeah. Okay. Nice. The storm is a brewing. Ooh, was that lightning? Oh my God. Whoa. What? What? What a vehicle. What a vehicle. BMW. Nice car. Nice That's a nice car. Clean. Oh no, we're about to get caught in a storm. Oh no. It is poor rig. The fat. Like big oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. They're huge. Whoa. Whoa. It is coming down. <gasps> you guys hear that? Thunder? Whoa. <gasps> Holy. Wow. Holy shit talks. That's crazy. I'm soaked. Let's see what we got here, a little Walmart um, haul. I spent $78,000, I don't know what. Oh, me and Zane spent like 30. Got some magic erasers to clean my sister's chairs tomorrow. Oh, look at look. Doritos. We got, oh, you guys got like salad and shit, that's why. And we got blueberries. Sugar free. We got some Gatorades for ourselves and some waters. That's it, that's it, that's all we got, right? Oh, and Zane got a pair of sneakers because tomorrow they're going quadding. Okay, hey. cute, Zane. Which I'm so jealous. Not yeah. bad, right? Look, you're all gonna have the same ones out. Only because I brought my dress shoes and then my all white shoes. So it's like, yeah. I, I got nothing in between. Nice. <laughs> I just hit record at the perfect time. The lights just went out. <gasps> oh my god, guys, this storm is really bad. We were like, go check on Jerry! Guys, we, we can't go out in this. No, we can't. We're gonna have to wait. Is that hail? Yes! Hail. It's hailing! Oh. Oh. Look at the water coming out of the gutter. I can't believe we just lost power. Oh, they came back. Yeah. Look at the front of the house. Oh, oh wow. Oh. oh my god, our power keeps going on and off. We're, we have to wait for this to pass to leave. We're gonna be all dressed up nice and get yeah. soaked. Yeah, it's supposed to stop soon inside. Okay, yeah. That's wild. Look at when the wind comes, you can't even like see. It gets like cloudy. Mm-hmm. All right, you guys, what a glow up. The lighting is horrible in here, so I have my iPhone light on, but just did my makeup. Um, started to run out of time, so I was like, let me just try to straighten my hair, and I actually really like it. I haven't done this in a while, and look at the length. Love that. The thickness, so good. These were my options. I rented this like long lacy one which i feel like is just way too fancy for tonight i didn't know what the vibe was gonna be but i want to make use of this so maybe i'll like do like a photo shoot with zane at home and i'll have him take pictures of me somewhere and then this one was just kind of like very like summery springy and i felt like this one that i rented was like the perfect vibe sorry babe you're in the background just so you know I'm good. What's up? What's up? <laughs> um so it's like this leather kind of like mid-length dress it's got a slit in the front it's brown um, it's very comfortable and it fits really good. So I just went with that one. I literally did not even try any of these dresses on. I just packed them and hoped that one would work. So that's my little look for the rehearsal dinner. I love this Anastasia lip. It's so good. It's so glossy, pretty. And I did my makeup really quick actually. So I feel like tomorrow for the wedding, I'm doing my own hair and makeup because her girl had like another gig and we were like, it's fine, I can just do my own. So I feel like tomorrow, once I like really take my time, my makeup will come out good, so I have faith. Um, but I'm gonna put on my little heels, I'm gonna wear my little coach bag, and that's that. We're going to the rehearsal dinner. Hello everyone, I actually didn't vlog not one clip at my sister's rehearsal dinner. I was just chatting with family, catching up. I didn't have one drop of alcohol either. I feel amazing. Well, TBH, I feel um, very bloated and full from the Torchy's tacos today. And then I had Doritos, that's all I ate today. And I just feel like ugh. So my sister had pizza, but I didn't have any. So we just stopped and I got salad and go. It's like a drive through salad place here and I've been wanting to try it. So I got a chicken Caesar salad and we're gonna do a salad shake. All right. Oh look, it says to shake it on here. You can't see it now. Oh, uh, uh, kinda. Mm-hmm. I just shook it. it. Looks amazing though. Let's say The drive through salad place, ain't that cool? I wanna try it every time I come here. And we got it right as soon as they were closing, we went and picked it up. Mmm. Yeah. You're like, why are you telling me that I was there? 
I'm sorry. Mmm. <laughs> That's good though. That means I've vlogged so like yeah. naturally. Sometimes you put shit out there, like when does she do You don't even realize I'm filming. Yeah, it's good. It's delicious. How's yours? Jerry? It's good? Oh good. It's my new little spot when I come here now. Salad and go. Dry fruit salad. And they have wraps and shit too. Well bet. Ten out of ten. Burger. The boys got Whataburger. You already know, man. Good for you. Texas. Come on. Good for you. It's time for bed. Tomorrow's the big day. I just used a makeup wipe. I need to get into my pajamas. I'm so ready for bed. I'm exhausted and tomorrow is like a 7.30 a.m. start time. So it's gonna be a really long day. So good night. Good morning, everyone. The lighting in the room that we're staying in is actually atrocious, but um, I am yelling, sorry. <laughs> um, it's like 7.30 in the morning. We're all getting ready to head out for the day. The boys are going quadding, so jealous. I really wanted to go, but I really have to be there to help my sister. Um, obviously, it's wedding day. So the boys are going quadding this morning, including my sister's fiance. We're all going to my sister's to help her prep everything. We're not getting ready until three o'clock, but she, we have a call time of 8 a.m. to help her because she's DIYing centerpieces and just setting everything up and bringing stuff to the venue and whatever. So we're like not getting ready now. We're gonna shower after we're done, get ready there. So we're just like packing up. I'm using my carry-on backpack. I'm just wearing um, like this top from Amazon. I don't know why I put you down because I'm still talking to you. <laughs> this top from Amazon and then like my Lulu shorts. I, we have to go, so that's why I'm like rushing and stuttering. Um, if I was smart though, I would have brought biker shorts that had a phone thing in them, but I have my Lulu bag, so I'll just keep this on me so I can have my phone with me. But I'm packing a backpack. I left my dress there, but I need like all my makeup, my toiletries, my hair tools. So I'm just packing all of that. I think I have everything. Um, okay, well, I'm not gonna need my Kindle, so that's gonna stay at our Airbnb. I'm gonna want a pair of sunglasses. I'll keep those with me. Oh, I might need nipple covers with a dress. I'm not sure. Those will go in the front here. I'm gonna bring my little phone stand, and I wanna bring my big tripod too. This guy, it's like a tall tripod just in case. I wanted to do a transition with Zane from like not dressed to dressed, but I think we're gonna be separated the whole time because the boys are obviously all getting ready together and then the girls are. So I think I'm gonna have to do that alone. Oh, you guys are dying. I'm gonna need to bring some camera batteries. Okay, I think we're all ready to go. And um, I don't know how much I'm gonna actually film today. Obviously I'm gonna be running around my sister, but I'll try to document a little bit for you guys, but her is the most important and making sure everything she wants and needs is done is the most important. Well, it's been running around getting ready, so I haven't really filmed, but <laughs> hair makeup's done. Dresses on, House of CB, Spanx, <laughs> Steve Madden. And I did my hair and my makeup, so hopefully it looks all right and it lasts all night. I feel like it's all right, it's all right. Okay, thank you. Thank you, all right. Here's a little mirror view of the hair, voluptuous. Okay, we gotta go, so. It is 1.02 a.m., which means it's 2.02 a.m. in New York. We're exhausted. Had so much fun. I'm gonna gather some iPhone footage from everyone. Some people were taking videos, so that's what you just saw, because I really did not film 
pretty much at all. It was such a hectic day and I was kind of like working hand in hand with the coordinator. So I was like running back and forth and I was like making sure everything was going good for my sister. So it was kind of hectic and a lot, but nonetheless, had so much fun. I'm so happy for them and I'm so tired and we're so hungry because we ate so long ago at the wedding. So of course we just got Whataburger, I got chicken fingers and fries and I can't wait to eat it and I can't wait to go to bed. I'm so tired, I have such a headache. I only had two drinks and I had so much fun with my cousins and my family. But I need to go eat. We're all gonna go sit at the kitchen table now and have a nice 1 a.m. Whataburger and then I'm going to bed. And tomorrow's our flight home. And this is what I look like. I had to take my hair out at the end of the night because I was pooped. And I'm so upset. I tried to do a short form video of like a transition and I got my before in my PJs and then I didn't do the after. So we're gonna have to make it like funny, you know? Anyways, good night. Good morning, happy Sunday. Me, Zane, Jerry, and Ever are packing up to head out today. We don't have to be at the airport until four o'clock. So we're gonna have a little family day. Everyone's shouting, sorry. But we're gonna have a little family day. We're gonna go to Katy, Texas, and we're gonna get um, cracklins, which is like fried chicken skin. We got it last time. We got Houdain. Houdan, Houdan, Houdan. And we're gonna have like a nice Texas, Texas meal. I think we're gonna walk around Katy a little bit, get some fresh air, go on a family walk, spend some time together. My parents are here for a few more days. So they're gonna drop us off at the airport. Our flight's not until like 6 something p.m. So yeah, we're gonna have a little day. So I just dressed comfy, but like it's kind of warm out, but also I know I'm gonna be cold traveling. So I just did. <sighs> Amazon tank leggings. My Dr. Scholl sneakers have been doing me so good. I love them because they look cute, but they're so damn comfortable. Like, so comfortable. I originally bought them for our Italy trip. I think I said that already, but highly recommend. And then I'm bringing my Aritzia hoodie for the airplane because it's gonna be cold. Um, yeah, we just all packed up, drinking some Gatorade. Only had two drinks last night and I feel amazing. Honestly, I had two and then I didn't think about it anymore. I didn't think, oh, I want another one. Should I have another one? I was just having fun. So I feel like that's amazing. I feel lovely. We hung out this morning, just chatting, had some English muffins. <laughs> it's been a really great trip. It was, it was so nice. My sister had such a good time. Wow. Came to a little family spot. We could do the mini golf. <laughs> the boys are doing batting cages. They're so cute. <laughs> yeah! You hear the song that's playing? I need you more than ever. Yes. <laughs> Come on, babe. Look how easy those are. There we go. Wow. Yeah, that's much better. <laughs> that was ridiculous. This one says baseball slow, softball slow, and the baseball was so fast. Hey, go! Hey, bada 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 bada. All right, we're on a family walk, and we found an open house. Ooh, fun! We're gonna go look. I'm gonna be like, just so you know, we're not interested. <laughs> just vibes. Five bedrooms. <laughs> oh, this is the master bathroom. <gasps> oh, that's the closet. Can we sit in your tub right <laughs> 620 this house is. What's this? Another closet. Is it his and hers? Oh yeah. That's in the bathroom. That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's hers. It's got a pool. Interesting. Little windows. Hello. If you have a dog, put, put the stuff there. No appliances for 620. Laundry room. Dining room. We're going upstairs. 3,400 yep. square foot? Oh, damn. Oh, does it go through? That's yeah, cool. Jack and oh, it's a Jack oh, and Jill. Cool. That's nice for like kids and stuff. And this side, one kid in that side. Yeah, that's like very cute. Like a connecting a balcony. Fun. Yeah, that's cute. This is really cool. I like the overlook. All right, last stop before the airport. We came here last time, it was delicious. So we're going again. Oh, fried goodness. Yum. All right, we got boudin balls. Chicken and pork crackling. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Is that? No, that's like. Mm-hmm. 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 Isn't that? I was gonna say, isn't that? Mm. It was not a good description. <laughs> wow. This is very cool. High school students made this with found objects. We are back at home, guys. Yeah. Imani picked us up from the airport. Just said hello to all the babies. <gasps> yeah, about to take a nice shower and go to bed, exhausted. It's like almost midnight, so quick little refresh, and we're going to bed. Gotta have a nice fresh start to the Monday tomorrow.
Hello, hello guys. Happy Monday. I just messed with the lighting on here. So if it's really orangey, I don't know. It was really cool toned before and it looked like washed out. So I needed some saturation, but hi, happy Monday. We're getting back in the groove of things after the vacay. I just wanted to do like a little debrief with you guys. I literally had so much fun, but wow. I've never been a maid of honor before. I'm using my TikTok brush. I've never been a maid of honor before and it was like a lot more than I thought during the actual wedding. The wedding coordinator was pulling me, and this could be different like everywhere, but for my sisters, the wedding coordinator was like using me for help for a lot of things of like, who's who, where's this person, we need this done. Um, we were supposed to play a video that I edited together for my sister and we were having technical issues. So I was like in the back room, like trying to help them with their projector. It ended up not being able to work, but I was like, it's fine. It'll be like a good intimate moment. It was like a, video of their dog that had passed it was like a really sad video and everyone was like having fun so i'm like honestly this would be so nice for the both of you to like watch it at home together so it worked out but it was like i was like doing stuff like that holding her bouquet making sure her dress is all done which bustling a dress was difficult as well i should have practiced that a little bit more but now we know <laughs> so with that being said i really just did not focus on taking pictures or anything we got some professional pictures from her photographer which she said she should have in like two days which is really quick and good so we'll see those but saves the day is the photo booth because I didn't take any iPhone pictures and I did take some photo booths not with my sister though I texted her and I was like what the hell we didn't take any pictures together besides the photographer ones she was like I know so once those come in I'll share but I was really happy that at least we took the photo booth pictures we just had so much fun my parents are still there they're flying home tomorrow and you guys are seeing this vlog tomorrow so it's very current and up to date we really had fun. It makes me even more excited for hours now. And it's so funny, my sister's husband, now I have to say my sister's husband, which is crazy. He was like, oh, I'm very excited for yours. So that it's so much less pressure and he could just be attending. But yeah, we had so much fun. All my cousins were there. We're actually gonna go out this weekend again with them because we had so much fun together. And it's fun when your cousins are all like around the same age as you and you can all go out and hang out together. So I think Zane and I are gonna go out with them this weekend. What is that? It was so nice to travel also with Zane's family. They had so much fun. They were like, when's the next vacation? They're gonna come next time we go there for Christmas because Jerry would love the Christmas, her Christmas town. If you, if you guys have seen how Christmassy my sister's town is, it's so fun. I don't think we're gonna do it this year just because we have both of our weddings and it's just been a lot, but next year we'll go back for Christmas again and we'll bring them with us. But she had a videographer there too, so eventually she'll have some video of it, but obviously that all takes time. So that is that. I feel so good after getting in my workout today. I've just really have been so on top of it and I feel so good. I feel like this is the most toned and in shape I've ever been. And it feels so nice. Oh, actually I need to put um, tanner on my hands should do that but we're gonna record the podcast do like a debrief of the weekend so there'll be more details on there i had wow a really not great person sitting next to me on the flight home it was not a good experience so we'll share that on the podcast if you want to hear about that that should be up actually it won't be up yet it'll be up on thursday got to the airport nice and early yesterday so jerry and i were sitting there people watching it's like one of our favorite things to do so that was fun but other than that, the sun is shining and it's gonna be a good Monday. I actually unpacked for the most part last night. Showered, washed my hair, unpacked, and I was still up and functioning for today, so love that. I have some wedding stuff to do because before we left, as you guys saw in the last vlog, we went to our wedding venue and met with a lot of vendors, so I need to respond to all those emails and phone calls, etc. So it was like we went to that and then we were out of town. I'm gonna set that up. I gotta make my consultation for my wisdom tooth removal, wisdom teeth removal, I should say. There's multiple. And my accountant called me while we were away too. Like, I have like a lot of like wedding and like responding to do random stuff like that so it's gonna be kind of my day today taking it chill after the vacay need a vacay after the vacay 
but I'll take you guys along and then we'll end this because I gotta upload it tomorrow. <laughs> hello, hello, podcast is done and guess who just made her consultation for wisdom tooth removal? I did. We're going this week, so hopefully it's not thousands and thousands of dollars. I do have dental insurance, so I hope that that's okay. I've seen different opinions of it could be covered, it could not be covered, so we shall see, but I got the referral and I made the appointment, so. They said to do it by this summer. I just really wanna know like what I'm up against and like, I just wanna go get it over with and get it out of my head. So I'm gonna go do that. Um, Zane and I are about to make some dinner. We're gonna do just some chicken thighs, potatoes, veggies, classic little dinner. I'm wearing my TikTok shirt and just some brown sweatpants, comfy clothes, and I gotta do some vendor emails for the wedding. That needs to be done. Wait, baby, did you see what we got? What? We got a email from somebody saying that Hey, we saw that you're getting married at this venue, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And long story short, they're offering, not for free, but they're offering to bring us in on a helicopter. No, we saw that vendor at the showcase. Remember we passed it and I was like, oh look, a helicopter vendor. We did? Yes. Oh, well they emailed us, I guess. Remember, and you were like, oh, and I was like, yeah, I have my hair and shit. I saw I them there. I really don't remember talking about no, that. No, I saw them at the, event, at the so. event we went to. But I just don't think. Absolutely not. I don't think that we should do no. that at all. First of all, we're gonna be at the venue. What are we gonna do, go up in the sky and come back down? No, absolutely not. I'd rather spend that money on a photo booth. I really liked my sister's photo booth. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah. You know what we should find out? Yeah. If we can keep all of the photos. Yeah, they're online. Oh, see, yeah, so like even people, if they're taking selfies without us, like just yeah, remembering Yeah, we can know? see them all, yeah. I can see everyone that took one at my sister's. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay, we're gonna take two on the french fry cutter. I'm gonna microwave the sweet potatoes, try to soften them a little bit, and then try to use it. Let's try again. Well, um, I did the sweet potatoes for like four minutes, and I thought that they're so large and hard <laughs> that, <laughs> that uh, it would take longer for them to soften. <laughs> And uh, they're really soft now, so they're just gonna mush if I try to french fry cut them. So you know what? We're gonna flip them over, microwave them for like another minute or so, and we're just gonna have um, a microwaved baked potato. And Betty, that's do you wanna wait so that yeah. it's hot when the chicken's done? Yeah, I'll do it for another minute when you're ready. We're just air frying chicken thighs and Brussels sprouts. That's our dinner. Easy, love it. And everyone, look at how cute Moogs is. She's such a Moogs. Would you love a sweet potato? She's overstimulated, so many sounds. All right, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Literally. It's been a few hours, I was just on my computer. I got a good amount of wedding stuff done, so look forward to that in the next few vlogs. I got a call with an officiant, and then we also have an in-person meeting with a florist this weekend. So that is gonna be so much fun, so. The wedding content is gonna start picking up. We're getting closer and closer to the wedding. I also had just like some emails to go through. I posted on social media. I scrolled a little bit, which is not my best moment, but I wasn't on my phone really pretty much all weekend. So it's bound to happen. And now your girl is hungry. You guys are gonna laugh at me, but I show you this because I just want to be real in that I don't always eat like very, like our dinner. It was very balanced and delicious and you would think I would just have like a little sweet treat and go to bed. And here I am a few hours later eating hot dogs on pieces of bread dipped in ketchup. I am who I am. <laughs> and if that makes you feel better about yourself, I'm all for showing it, okay? Sometimes you wanna eat a damn hot dog on a piece of bread. I'm winding down for the night. I am gonna watch the fourth movie in the after series. I will update you guys on this. I am about halfway through. I don't like it at all. I know people say like, oh, life's too short to read books you don't like. But for some reason, I just need to finish this one to finish off the series. I just need to finish it. So I made some good progress on the trip, on the flights. I'm gonna finish it off. I don't know. I'm just like not as motivated to read it. It is literally the first book in the series, just in his perspective, which the first book was in hers and then the rest of them switched back and forth. So I feel like I was already in his head and I know what he would have thought. I'm just not learning any new information. So I'm really hoping that the second half comes together in some sort of new way. But that's just my personal preference. I really don't like when books repeat the same storyline in a different perspective. It's just not my jam. So that's where I'm at on this book. So far I would say, you don't even need to read it, honestly. But with that being said, I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Big congrats to Sissy and Chris. They are married. She's a whole wife now. And now it's my turn. Let the wedding festivities begin. I feel like now that my sister's is over, it's like, all right, we got my batch, my bridal shower, our wedding. Like, it's gonna be so much fun. So, speaking of fun, we've got like um, a month until we leave for 
our Europe trip. We're going to Italy and then another surprise destination, which there's no reason to keep it a surprise, but I just feel like it's something fun to do. So I'll keep it a surprise for you guys. But wow, that trip is creeping up fast and I cannot wait. Like I am so excited. I'm so excited to go on that trip, especially now that we, you know, rebooked it for warmer weather. I'm like, maybe we can get in some beach days. The cats are fighting. It's just gonna be a whole nother vibe. I'm so excited for that. Anyways, okay, now I'm renting. I'm gonna eat my hot dogs now, and I'm gonna watch this movie and go to bed. I'm gonna pick up another vlog. Can we not fight? I'm gonna pick up another vlog this week. You guys are literally seeing this tomorrow. So, very current right now. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys. One, two, one, two, three, four. Hello? Lovely, and I had what? How funny! How I just eat. <coughs> yeah. okay. I don't remember how to do this. What are you talking about? Your makeup. What do you mean? Like, there's so many steps. No, that's not. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just want everything away. Jesus! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! You can take one and drink it on the way, and I'll get to the airport. Fill it up. I just, it's not my, it's just not my jam, so. The lighting in the room that we're in. Wow. Don't answer me like that.